it's Whimsy, and we're back today with a new episode of Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. Very excited, as always, to play. I really loved last episode as well. We just arrived in the grasslands. We unfortunately left a bit earlier than I intended. Um, calm. I didn't know that reaching the clock tower, first of all, was the main scenario. I know it was written and everything, but I just didn't notice. And second of all, I didn't know that it would lock us out of the city, right? Because you reach the clock tower and then Shinra arrives and you have to leave. So I, I was actually thinking about that before last time I filmed and now. I was thinking about that and... I wonder why they didn't put a warning because they used to do that in Final Fantasy VII Remake. They would put a warning saying, are you sure you want to head over this? Or like the game would be like, you should do your side quest before continuing, you know, that kind of thing. The only thing that was said was Aerith saying, go to the bookshop, you know, the folio stuff first and, and then you can come and see me. But there were pretty sure there were many other things to do that I just didn't see unfortunately so I wonder why they didn't you know I would have liked a little pop-up saying are you sure you want to head over the clock tower then I would have been like wait okay maybe not you know maybe I want to go around first so anyways I, I'm not trying to excuse you know but I'm just it's a little bit of an, a nitpick uh, criticism that I'm doing right now, but I just switched the... Maybe they'll patch it, you know, maybe they'll add a, uh, a little bit of a warning there because it's the beginning of the game too, you know, you're learning so many things and, and everything. So it's kind of a bummer that they put a, a lock, a region lock so soon in the story and not tell you that it's gonna be locked, you know? not even allude to it so unless i missed it you know maybe they alluded to it and i missed it but i edited that episode and i i couldn't really notice if they said anything other than Eret saying what i said earlier so anyways it's done it's done you know we can't do anything about it so we'll just continue the grasslands and hopefully we can go back to calm eventually and maybe see what we missed but yeah let's jump it with let's go Let's go! So we finished off with some hardcore parkour. <laughs> I actually wanted to switch difficulty. I think we're at a point where we can do that now. I'm feeling pretty comfortable. You know, it's actually a little bit easy. It's the beginning of the game, of course, but I'm gonna try dynamic today and see if we really see a difference or not. But makes me really excited. I should have just went with that. And uh, was there something else that I wanted to see? Comment. So whether or not the game remembers the last character used on the commands menu outside of battle. Okay. Uh, okay. Party member. Reverse. From bottom to top. Okay. Uh, oh, combo targeting. Wait. Oh. Uh, I prefer free. I actually used free in the uh, 7 remake. Yeah. And... Dynamic or... Oh, I like I like uh, static. I want to keep static for the minimap. Uh, display area. Okay. And... I guess I guess that's it guys for now we'll see we'll see if it changes really anything uh, all right can we <laughs> leave there now all right let's go back up oh it's back the the stuff responds well that makes it very easy nice all right uh, there was another chest around here that I missed. Uh, I know I got one, but I missed another. Uh, I'm sorry. Let's see. Ah, oh, here. There we go. Yay! Very nice. Uh -huh. Wow. Ah, uh, so cool. 
Also, how do you switch? I think... Ah! Okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. So if I want to try... Maybe Aerith? I see enemies there. Hello. Bring it on. Or Rathlin Wolf. Woo! It's on him. Woo! So cool. Okay, wait. Uh, let me. Synergy abilities. Okay, wait. Vitalizing ATB commence marked with that will grant character synergy. When two characters share enough synergy, you can activate their synergy abilities. These abilities not only deal tremendous damage, but also apply unique buffs, such as increasing limit breaks, granting unlimited MP, or extending the duration enemies are staggered. Note that repeated use of synergy ability will increase the amount of synergy required to activate it. Very nice. Uh, yeah, but I wanted to assess the wolf. Too bad. Actually, pearl beasts. Yes. Blocking their spin swipe attack or evading them when they attempt to, to pin you will pressure them. Yeah, that's what just happened earlier. I evaded and they got pressured because of that. I mean, it got pressured. Okay. Don't overdo it. Yes, Aerith. Adept at long-range magic attacks. Press square to unleash magic attacks capable of hitting multiple targets. Hold down square to charge the Tempest kill. Oh, it's not with the triangle anymore? Striking an enemy with the scale fully charged will summon a fleeting familiar. Oh, that's different. That's why there was the not so, not so fleeting familiar uh, skill, but I didn't take that, I think. Press triangle to instantaneously warp between any magic wards. Aerith has conjured. What? That's so cool. What do you mean? So it's my turn. Ward shift. You'll see. That'll I'm do. just trying things out. Sorry. <laughs> Looking for me? <laughs> Sorry, but I gotta. That's okay. Arcane Ward. Let's try. More magic. <laughs> okay. Oh, it was a troll clamp earlier. <laughs> Here we go. Yeah. Oh, that's so cool because you can do one, for example, for Tifa. No, Cloud right now. Like this. Oh, it stops your the one you have. Ah, I, I was about to warp. That's so cool. I love that. I love that. Okay. All right. That was nice. And we will try Red 13 next time. I haven't tried yet. I'm very excited to see how he, you know, how he is in combat. I mean, we saw a little bit in. What is this? We saw a little bit in remake, you know how he is, but it was not the same. What is that? Hello. <laughs> what? <laughs> what is going on here? It's so funny. All right. There were some uh, Moogle medals, so that's good. I think that's a rest stop, isn't it? Yeah. Yes! Resting at Chocobo Star? Oh, so cute! What is that? That's like a super tiny Chocobo. What? I want one. I'm gonna have one later. Did he just pull out a tissue to, not a tissue, but a cloth to, yeah, to sit down because it's too dirty? 
Oh, Cloud, I had no idea he was such a clean person. <laughs> well, many chocobo stops built in the days of the Republic. Okay, it's the first time we hear about a Republic, I think. Have fallen into disrepair. Their benches are mostly intact. If you use a cushion, okay, okay, you can sit down for a rest, which will fully replenish your HP and MP. I have five right now. Sure, let's try it. You know, it's just a tutorial. It's gonna cost me still, but... <laughs> okay, we can probably uh, craft cushions, I'm hoping. Let's, let's go see, actually, if I have that. Where is my tiny chocobo? We can't right now, but... Oh, I could add to to-do list. That's very nice. Let's do that for the things that I need to craft for the first time. Um, so now it's here. Cool. I'm guessing the game will like tell you when it's ready to craft or something. That's nice. Hey. <laughs> Woo. Too strong. <laughs> Fighting as Red 13. Can definitely take down enemies with his razor sharp claws and fangs. Press square to swipe at falls and hold it down to unleash a whirling slash. Oh, so cool. Successfully guarding against attacks fills the Vengeance Gauge, which can be consumed with Triangle to enter Vengeance mode, increasing Red 13's attack power and dodge speed. Vengeance mode can be activated at any time, but it will last longer according to how full the gauge is. Follow Come my on. Is that it? That's very ah. cool. <laughs> Going in feeding time. Sentinel stands guard against attacks to greatly increase vengeance gauge. Counter strike, okay. And leap into the air to deliver a punishing blow from above. And we have Stardust Ray. That costs two ATP. Come on. Woo! All comes down to this. He can spin forever, or pretty much. I want to try. Hell yeah! He's so much fun to play with. Wait, this is so nice. Oh, I love it. I love it. Okay. Uh, I should probably stop exploring so much. Um. I'm gonna do like this area, but we're not gonna do too much, guys. I, I kind of want to see if we're gonna get... Because we just saw chocobos at this stop. So if we get chocobos, actual chocobos that I can ride... I'm gonna go crazy, first of all. <laughs> Second of all, I think it would make things way easier. So, uh, like, it would go faster, right? So I'm thinking that we could explore when we have a better mode of transportation because I can't imagine this is all by foot I would be surprised wow dude Jesus maybe we can teleport later I don't know Ooh, what are those hello yeah I know about that wait is it because they're like really difficult Let's do this. Oh, okay. Okay, they use like ice. Ah, I was about to. Okay, anyways, let's assess. Does I have a voice? Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Expl <laughs> Explaining their elemental weakness will pressure them. While the guard is up, lending powerful offensive abilities from behind will pressure them, but also cause them to see red. Uh, weaknesses are fire and ice. Oh, they give beast pelt and stuff. Beast bone can be 
more football items. What does that mean? Dude? This won't take long. Whatever. Uh, Keep it together. Just let's to see what I can do. Uh. Okay, so that's. I have well struck. Watch this. Woo! Woo! Oh, let's try it. Stardust Ray. What? What do you mean? That was crazy. <laughs> what? I cannot right now. Holy shit. That's insane. <laughs> that was an insane attack. Woo! Okay, so that's where I'm supposed to go, I think. I'm not gonna go over there. I'm just gonna go around basically this um, this area. If that's okay with you guys, of course. Not that you can see anything about it right now. <laughs> All right. Maybe... Oh, beautiful. <gasps> Hello! Oliver's farm! Hey, it is so cute! Oh, <laughs> little cows! Don't mind me. All necessary materials gathered for smelling salt. Nice. I like that it's in the... I like that it's in purple, you know, so you can see it a bit more easily. Ooh. Hello! You're so cute! Alright. Can't really talk to those. Blessing. That's such a nice, a nice item name. Okay, windmills. Hello. Hello, friends. Can I go in there? No. Oh, thank you, Barrett. <laughs> Barrett just casually walking on Shinra boxes. I love it. go see around here and then I promise we'll go uh, we'll go to the main objective just going around a little quick is it like a place of interest when there's Mako like that maybe I'm not sure it's like when a name appears there's also that little Mako thing going on. Oh, I can't go there. By the way, I've had this song in my head non-stop for the past, past few days. Ever since Rebird came out, I am like non-stop humming this song. Magnificent, isn't it? Mildred. A Republic original. Republic original. Hmm. If only there was some way to get it moving again. Maybe I can do that. 
Magnificent, isn't it? These things, okay. The Republic. What is that about? Hmm. Oh, that was something else. <laughs> that was intense. Okay. The steampunk elements are so cool. Oh, rare stuff here. sure if there's really something to do here. Why does it do that? Hmm. Oh, really? Okay. I guess there's uh, nothing to do here. For now, I got a caution. Let's go. <laughs> okay, so I think we can go to the house now. my god oh that was so scary i'm sure there is no like fall damage but <laughs> that was still scary Ugh, the mako everywhere is like leading me i feel but i'm not sure i might be just imagining things What is that? Ah, <laughs> oh, folios, nice. Oh, that's nice. Okay. Wait. Uh. Yes, please. Thank you. For a Barrett. Overcharge. For red. Counter spin, why not? Synergy skill, synergy ability damage, and a wind without expanding. Sure, let's try it. And for you, ice guaranteed hit. Huh. That was Tifa though, the, the video was Barrett, but it was Tifa. Vending machine! I offer a variety of useful items that will aid you on your adventures, such as potions, plumes of Phoenix Down. They also sometimes offer limited quantities of certain items at special prices. Save some guilt to stock up on these resources while they are on sale. Yes. So we have... Oh, Kashan, yes! Thank you. And, uh, oh, oh, yeah, all right, I'm, I'm down. Those are all the products. Oh, there is steel. Honestly, yeah, I'm gonna buy this one. I know I usually don't buy that many, um, uh, Materia, but this one I really want. Oh, sorry, Materia. <laughs> uh, maybe. Oh my god, I put. I can put many of them. Maybe on you. I don't know. Oh, everybody has. Okay. 
Ooh. And now... Can we... Wait... Okay, so... So... The things that I just bought are passive, basically, right? The folios thing? Okay. They are just passive stuff. Tifa... It was... Okay, I I guess I guess we're fine. I still need to understand a little bit how that works. <laughs> Let's rest and then we'll speak with the. Uh... So those rests, you don't need cautions. Ca cautions. I'm sorry, I'm mispronouncing. I think. But in Chocobo stops you need if you want full. Uh... Hi. This stuff here ain't feed for the animals. It's your bed. When it ain't been dried enough, they get all bent out of shape. They start pecking at my head like it's a damn. You be the avalanche, folks. It's okay, I'm on your side. Heard you be heading my way. You're safe here, but not for long. By the sound of it, Shinra's leaving no stone unturned. Might want to hole up at the old dock out by the swamp. I'd wait your shimmer's forgotten it's even there. The swamp, eh? Co-conspirator. I wish there was something more I could do, but I ain't got the space to put y'all up. Swamp's your best bet. Alright then. Okay. That's quite far. So that was this Oliver. Stuff here ain't feed for the animals. It's your bed. They were not talking earlier, but now they are. <laughs> I don't know what's going on. <laughs> Just talking with him. Unlocked everything. I don't know. Okay. So we head over here. All right. View chapter list. Okay, cool. Abandoned dock. Let's go then. Bye. So I think we've pretty much seen most of the things around here. I'm gonna let those be. They're, they shouldn't attack, right? They respawn. Every, every, I don't know how many, how long, but you know, they respawn. my mini map right now i don't know if it's i saw in the settings maybe i can change that uh sorry uh select select which navigational tool appears while exploring the world at large Okay, I see. So you can do L1. I think I like that better, actually. And you see it on the map, too. Oh. Hello. Easy. <laughs> okay. You're not doing too good. Let's do this. Take the lead. 
Leave it to me. Uh, that's not what I wanted to do. Wait. Okay. Can I steal something from you? Failed. Oh? Oh, I thought I could do one. Ah, oh, what? What's, what's that? Is that the summon thing? Okay, you need a lot of uh, ATB, I guess. be able to do any of those hey, don't come back <laughs> uh should we be worried about those things we're fine how can you be so sure because I've read the field guide like any good soldier what local things? wildlife will only attack while on the hunt or in defense of their territory Fiends, on the other hand, attack without reason. If they're attacking, what does it matter? It matters if your nose can discern their intent before they attack. As I gather, yours can't. Okay, what animal are we talking about? I didn't, uh, I didn't see. <laughs> Oops. I'm going in a straight line, guys, so I know I'm probably missing, you know, a lot of stuff, but I'm sure we'll have time to to come back, you know, it's no big deal. A ruby? Huh. All right, then. That's the duck. Here we go. That's the purple thing. Oh, weapon! I'm hoping it's a weapon! <gasps> we didn't have to buy it! Why, thank you, game. That's very nice. Why is item transmuter the first thing? They should have put material and equipment first. I'm sorry. I don't have focus trust yet, though. Ooh, it's a lot better though. What the? <laughs> and I can set a skill. ATB charge rate up increases ATB recharge rate when performing actions. And increases the number of consecutive slashes with strong attacks in Punisher mode. Very nice. Okay then. We have a new weapon. Woo! Oh, chocobo! Oh. Oh, this one thing. Not poisonous, no I hope. Sign of We're not in from software. Yeah. We should be fine. Looks like an old republic landing. Could borrow a boat, make our way across. Then head on through the mines and keep going till we hit Juna. Sure. Why not? You trust these rotting hulks? I mean, we could. Let's not. Then maybe we swim it. <laughs> <sighs> this swamp is home to the deadly Midgard swarm. Oh, that's what I Beware. saw. Yeah, I was, I was trying but to look at the posters. Even if you're slow, you can rent a chocobo. Hey. We'll see you safely past being nothing if not fast. So just give Bill the word and he'll pick you out. A bird! <laughs> That's... I love that. It rhymes. Well... Can we rent some birds? Can we? Yes, absolutely. Fine. <laughs> <gasps> Chocobo! I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm uh, getting too excited here, but that's so nice. Oh, did you see the reflection of Red 13's tail on the sword? Wow, okay. Damn, the detail. That's so nice. I love lighting like that. And the music. Doom, doom, doom. 
ominous. Also, uh, monster. T okay, are you following us? Like, what's going on? <laughs> Let's try this. This ends here. It's on now. Gee. Oh, I haven't assessed that. Time. I got your number. Okay. Keep it together. I'm coming. Okay. Over here. Woo! Go on. Yeah. You'll see. Someone looks kind of shaky. That's so much fun. I love that they put a little blue dot for what you need to do. See if you gain proficiency, I mean. I do that again. Level up! Everybody leveled up. Okay, cool. Wow. I need a. <gasps> we don't need to rest right now. We're fine. Let's go. Go on. Holy, dude. Dead. Wow, it. it's lightning and fire. Very cool. Again. This ends here. One step at a time. Is does it take longer to get no, okay, oh, we almost got it. Never mind. I think I got a proficiency bonus. Was it like to kill an enemy with that? Exploit an enemy's weakness. Okay, okay. Yeah, fire and lightning. It's lightning first and then fire. But yeah. And it's nice also, you see the stats under, so you don't have to just look at what's written. You can just look down. Oh, okay, this weapon is better stat wise. And we also have a materia as well. It looks so good too. Well, already better than our Buster Sword. I'm sad. <laughs> I really love the Buster Sword. Such a cool attack, dude. <laughs> yes, we got it! Oh, natural spring. What is that? So bad. The movement is so good of Cloud. Oh my lord. I know I'm not using a lot like the other characters. I'm not swapping much because it's just I'm trying to see everything that has changed, you know, and yeah, it's just really nice. No holding back. <laughs> Come on. I have almost Here perfect luck. Okay. Again. Gotcha. <laughs> that was not perfect. That was perfect. Sorry. Right. Trying to see how the berry works. You're dead. Yeah. It's on now. It's on you. You got this. Let me Thank you. Woo! I think it's good to put on dynamic because you can get really really high level fast i feel like yeah i know i'm i'm not exploring a lot right now it's on purpose guys okay i just don't want you to think that i'm gonna uh not you know i i am actually working really hard right now to not explore 
<laughs> because I want to get a chocobo first and then maybe we can explore you know and and also I think it's good that I do uh, that's what I'm gonna try to do for this playthrough basically I want to do a very thorough playthrough but since it's an open world it's gonna take a while so what I'm thinking of doing is every episode I'm gonna try my hardest to do main stuff at least once in the episode and then explore if we want to but at least continue the main story every time we film basically and I'm hoping side quests we can just do anytime since it's open world maybe it's not as like locked in maybe it is we'll see but uh we can spend maybe an episode on side quests or something like that every now and then and then maybe the rest stuff like queen's blood and things like that I'm not sure I might stream them when I'm done with the game or something like that that that's kind of like my plan right now I don't want it to be too much side stuff all the time because I feel like it's gonna take me forever first of all and second of all it's not that interesting for you guys maybe so that's my plan so far how I'm gonna well well schedule this basically if it ain't my favorite group of hitchhikers oh hello fancy meeting you here thanks again for the ride to calm ah uh, don't mention it it's the least I could do for two such lovely young ladies but I do believe I neglected to introduce myself. Yeah, I don't... The name's Bill. Oh. And you can count on me for a lift anytime. Oh, okay, I remember. The end of a uh, remake, Anywho, right? what can I do you for? You in the market for some fine-feathered friends by any chance? Are the end of the ever? DLC, Need them right? to get through the swamp lands. Then you have come to the right place. Back in the day, we had Republic ferries to get us from A to B. But now they're nothing but driftwood, sadly. We got the next best thing, though. Chocobos. Yes. To them, a bottomless bog's no worse than a kiddie pool. Now, ladies, oh you're God. probably wondering, what gives these birds the power to glide across swamps with ease? Uh... Would you believe that their fluffy feathers give them the buoyancy to float while their limber legs can outrun a motorboat? <laughs> Not even the dreaded Midgard Sormer, one of the fastest fiends around, can keep up with them. Uh, wow. Okay. But you don't need convincing. You just need pointing to a hard-working chocobo. Nature's two-legged limousine. I'm so excited. <laughs> so can we rent some? Sure can. My grandson Billy's in the stable over yonder. He'll help you out. <gasps> Okay, let me rest first. I'm so happy I could cry right now. <laughs> I've I've wanted chocobos to ride a chocobo ever since we saw them in remake. I want them as a pet. I want to pet them as well, please. Oh, we have a discount. We can see it. Oop. Caution. Okay. And oh, that's sad. <laughs> Oh well. Wait, what if I sell? We can't sell materia. Oh, Hunter, I didn't see if it was better. Yay! This one is with Barrett, this one's with Arid. Yeah, I think we could get another. Barrett and Red 13. Very nice. Uh, sure, we'll unlock that. And bear it. Okay, uh. Can team up with any partners with Iron Defense. That's really cool. Wild Charge. Yes. Nice. Uh, for equipment. Yeah, I was thinking... Uh... Ooh. Yes. <laughs> okay. So 
Joe! Hello, can I pet you? Oh my god, how can they be so cute? Look at them. They are too cute. I cannot deal. Uh, Aerith, what are you doing? <laughs> Look at them! Oh my god, they're so cute. <laughs> okay. Hello! Howdy! Howdy! It's all inside. Need some chocobos to cross the swamp. So every chocobo no, owner is sorry, like... sorry, Pops, but you're out of luck. Pops? Got no Not more that birds. old. Last one went this morning. Could have fooled me, kid. Uh, These are spoken for. That or they're not fit for riding. <coughs> but I can see you're in a bind, so I'll bump you up the list. For a price, of course. Which is? Ten grand each. <laughs> the thing is... Excuse me. We don't have that kind of money. Or any, really. Hmm. Well, there is one other option. Only cost you a grand. Uh. Is what a scoundrel might say. But I wouldn't dream of distressing y'all further. Just so happens one of our birds ran off the other day. Wild thing, but still a fine chocobo. If you can manage to find and catch him, then he's yours. Free of charge. Oh, nice. You yes. sir? Yeah, why not? Name's Pico. The hardest-headed bird you'll ever meet. By Pico. far. And he's the spitting image of Pops here. <laughs> you can start by looking for his tracks. Find those, and you're sure to find the feet that made him. Now, wild chocobos can be a bit skittish around people. But if you play it cool and creep up real quiet-like, you'll wrangle him no problem. I think we can do that. Thanks. And one last thing. This info comes free of charge, provided you promise to stop by our shop. Speak to Chloe back there. She'll sell you whatever you need. <laughs> Kids are born businessmen. Yep. <laughs> if y'all can catch our runaway and get his butt back here, riding and rearing They're lessons so are young. on me. Yeah, every chocobo owner is like a cowboy, kinda. Need something? Uh, how can I find wild chocobos? How do I catch a wild chocobo? Tell me about riding gear. Start by looking for fresh tracks. Once you spot them, birds are rarely more than a stone's throw away. Okay. Birds in the wild are much more skittish than kept ones. Gonna have to be real quiet on the approach, else they'll bolt. Gear serves all sorts of purposes, from the cosmetic to the practical. Nice. Can even improve a race bird's performance. Okay. Won't cost you a gill. Golden plumes only. Good luck wrangling Pico. <sighs> Ooh! Excuse me, what kind of weapon? <gasps> For Aerith. Okay. No. That's gonna take a while to get used to. Raise a barrier that damages and temporarily freezes enemies who attempt to strike you. Ooh. But I don't have Arcane Ward. Uh. I need focus trust as well. Yeah, I'm gonna switch when I get my actual proficiencies only. Sorry about my brother. All he thinks about is money. <laughs> he's just doing his job. Oh, the table. We understand. <laughs> Sorry. I suppose, but he's been a real pain about it ever since our parents left. <gasps> left. Say, are you guys from Midgar? Yeah, the Undercity. Then, do you happen to know Chocobo Sam? Yeah, we do! Um, not very well, but... Yeah, I guess we do. Where is he? Probably the Sector 6 slums. He's a big deal in Walt. Um, why do you ask? I was... thinking about reaching out. It's his fault Mom and Dad are gone, so... Chloe, that's none of these good folks' business. But they could help! Don't tell anyone what she told you. Sam's one of the biggest names in the business. 
If he gets wind of that story, our ranch is done. Oh, for. gee, okay. Don't worry, your secret's safe with us. I promise. Oh, take these greens. You can give them to Pico when you find him. They were always his favorite treat. You yes. See. Maybe he'll come like back radishes. once he's had a taste. Right. Should probably sell you stuff, huh? Billy will throw a fit if I don't at least try to get you to spend a few gil. No pressure, but if anything catches your eye. Also, what if you happened? have any golden plumes on you, I can exchange them for chocobo gear. So be sure to hand them over if you do. Chocobo gear. What happened with Sam? What a bully. Arrange's tax shop will have chocobo gear for sale, which can only be traded for golden plumes. These rare feathers can be obtained by wrangling new chocobos or repairing chocobo stubs. Repairing chocobo stubs. <laughs> That's so cute. Bye. Uh huh. Required. Oh, two of this. Let's just try it like that. I hope Pico doesn't give you all too much trouble. What if I talk to her again? Welcome, folks. Okay. You're welcome back here anytime. We can go up. Excuse me, what? Where is the... Okay, we don't know how far... Oh, we need to check around, basically. We need to check for plumes, All right? right? Pico. Where'd you run off? Pico. You mean Pico? Let's try looking for some tracks. Maybe behind? I don't... Oh, I see a chest. That was a feather plume. Plume is feather in uh, French, by the way, if you didn't know. <laughs> okay, the fact that we like break everything all the time is so funny though. Like, oh lord. <laughs> I don't know, it's just really intense. <laughs> ah, the physics. Okay, so we ran away, so probably. I don't know, like probably out here, right? Oh! 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 Oh, we see the... the feet as well. We need to be careful and not too loud. Oh! Oh, we'll need to eat in those. Eat. Hid in those bushes, maybe? There is two. Bingo. Which one? Yeah! Come on, y'all! Let's go bag us a chocobo! <gasps> Keep it down. When you're on the hunt, you don't want to startle your prey. Prey? You know we're not here to kill him, right? I know, but yeah. we still need to... We're still hunting, in a way. Approach Pico without being noticed. If you're in danger of being spotted by him or one of your packmates, quickly press a circle to roll out of sight. You can easily distract chocobos by throwing stones you pick up. Use L1 to aim and square to throw. Oh, 
What do I do with this one? I'm guessing it's not the one I need, right? I, I mean, I know it's not the one. Pico is all the way over there, but... Minigame checkpoint updated? Nice. So cute. Okay, I picked up a rock. Oh boy. What was it again? Aim. <laughs> See the bar? Here we go. <laughs> we had there's a baby hidden there no i don't know but you know where there's more bill's place oh, okay never mind <gasps> i thought maybe that's why he ran away Back ran away ranch it is then come on wait, 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 you're so fast my god <laughs> Oh, that was so much fun. Also, they said he's cute, and then they said that he looks like me as Cloud, so that means Cloud is cute. <laughs> Are we good? Yes. a little taste of home, now does it? Hmm. Huh. <laughs> Not so much as a feather out of place. Got one healthy bird here. Enough to ride? Sure. Though I wouldn't try till he's done eating. Once he's out of spill, though, I'm sure he'll come around to the idea, if we ask him nice. Ain't that right. I'll need to prep his gear and all that, so why don't you wait outside? I have to... Can I... I really can't thank you enough for bringing Pico back to us. Uh, torso... Legs... But we don't know what it does. Headgear... Maybe legs? I don't know. If you ever want to change your chocobo's gear, feel free to use the stable just over there. Where? Oh, here. Oh, it was my discovery thing that I needed to do. Once Pico is ready. Okay, sorry. Hey, Cloud. Who is that? Chappy! Hey there. What a pleasant surprise. You do remember Of course me, I do. Don't you? How could I forget? Yeah. I knew you would. It was an absolute pleasure working with you in Midgar. Thank you again. Your invaluable intel allowed me to create so much material. <gasps> Detecting internal monologue. The hell's this weirdo doing here? 
<laughs> what? I was created by Professor Hojo, you know. Though your thoughts could be read by any cyborg. What? But to answer what? your question, I took a page out of your book and skipped town. Now, the whole world's my laboratory. Speaking of which, I have a favor to ask, if it's not too much trouble. You need more battle intel. That's the cloud I know. Always eager to get on with it. But yes, though, I'd like you to activate some Remna Wave Towers first. They were originally constructed by the Republic of Juno, I saw but earlier. were claimed by Shinra after the war. Since Republic which time they of sat Juno. idle and untouched, just waiting for someone to put them to good use. That's the Republic we keep The more towers you activate around about. the world, the more my processing power will grow. As will the area I can survey. I might even be able to construct a communications network independent of Shinra. How does that sound? You'd not only be helping me, but yourselves as well. I'm down. If we find any, we'll turn them on. Wonderful. I thought you might say something like that. Let's get started then. See that tower? That's your first target. And this will activate it. He is a s the chat module. He's a As cyborg. The by, Borg. Allow cyborg? Me to accompany you. Cyborg, cyborg. How did he say it? What? Created by Hojo. But sentient and now left Shinra. What the hell? That's a thing? He looks human. <laughs> That's a thing? I didn't know that. <laughs> I I love him. I still love him. It doesn't change anything. Here we are. Do you have some VR uh, missions for me? By any chance? Activation confirmed. Initiating preliminary scan of the grasslands. Ooh. I'll ascertain the locations of fiends and natural resources. Fiends? Combat registration? Combat register. <laughs> oh! No fucking After way. After careful consideration, I have devised a new name for this type of research. I call it World Intel. Chadley will employ the data you collect to develop new materia, create new combat simulations, and embark on other scientific endeavors. Activate the Remna Wave towers you encounter and help Chadley deepen your understanding of this world. The I hope you'll assist me in gathering relevant data by completing various tasks on your travels. I shall. In return, I will use the information you provide to develop new materia. Quid pro quo. To summarize, I want Quo-quo. us to become research partners. But before that... Is there anything you would like to ask? These communications towers were built by the Republic of Junon I thought in order to sorry. further their understanding of the planet. They scan for all manner of signals, which in turn reveal myriad locations of interest, mm -hmm. such as long forgotten ruins and rare natural phenomena. Mm -hmm. Should you happen to stumble across a tower, please activate it. I must urge you to proceed with caution though. Feral beasts often claim these installations as their territory. Mm. Do you happen to have any questions about world intel and the like? Combat simulator. With a special pair of goggles, you can do battle in a virtual arena, regardless of your real world location. That's the combat simulator. Or my combat simulator, as Shinra developed the stationary models first. I can do it anytime. And fret not, it will never be obsolete. I'll keep it up to date with intel from unique enemy encounters. I will also endeavor to implement all of the summons once I finish analyzing the myths and legends surrounding them, of course. In fact, after pouring over stories from the grasslands, I have finished implementing a new one. The tower and colossus <gasps> known as it. Titan. Engage Titan. him at your leisure. Do you happen to have any questions about world intel and the like? I'm so excited. Specific intel related tasks. Which particular task would you like to learn about? Life Spring. Simply put, 
life springs are formed when the life stream breaches the planet's surface. Mm. To Shinra, the volume of Mako that can be extracted from these springs is insignificant, certainly not worth the expense. But to us, the one we they see are a like veritable this. font of knowledge. In order to tap these precious reserves, however, you will first need to find them. Maybe. If you still have questions about Maybe world we intel, found a please ask away. Combat assignments. While it is normal for creatures to adapt to their environment, sometimes these adaptations make them a threat. I would like you to track down and eliminate these creatures and amass data on them in the process. If you still have questions about world intel, please ask away. Crystal analysis. In certain remote areas, fragments of planetary wisdom have coalesced into crystalline forms. Though the knowledge contained within them is vast and varied, one subject is of particular interest to me, that of summons. If you would analyze the crystals in my stead, thus extracting said knowledge from them, I can use it to enhance our materia. Oh, wow. If you still have questions about world intel, please ask away. Proto relic salvaging. Ah, yes. I was hoping you would uh -huh. ask. I detected some strange energy signals earlier. My current theory is that they emanate from the remnants of ancient artifacts. But until we investigate, there's simply no telling what the sources might be. And since we have yet to identify them, I have taken the liberty of naming these objects Proto Relics. <laughs> A rather endearing <laughs> name, if I may say so. At any rate, I would that? be grateful if you could investigate said curiosities so and ultimately cute. recover them for study. If you still have questions about world intel, Me? please ask oh. away. No, nope, we're good. Do you happen to have any questions about world intel and the like? Developing materia. With each piece of world intel you collect, you will also provide me with the data I need to develop new materia. What I ultimately produce, however, is for you to decide. I look forward to finding out what we can create together. Do you happen to have any questions about world intel and the like? No, nope, we're good. In that case, I see no reason not to begin at once. With your activation of this tower, my analysis of the grasslands has already yielded some data. Yes! Though hardly substantial, it is enough for me to create materia. <gasps> what Which is of it? these would you like? I choose fire and ice. Enemies whose health has fallen below a certain amount can be defeated in this fashion. Also, an ally to automatically use unique, use unique abilities when not actively controlled during battle. Tifa will also use Unbridled Strain when not actively controlled. That's so good. And... Fire and Ice. I wish you all the best in the long journey that lies ahead of you. You don't and need remember, fire not and ice separately. Should you require assistance, just ask. Assessing and defeating new things will provide Chadley with the data he needs to update the simulator with combat challenges. Complete these challenges to earn a variety of rewards such as powerful summoning materials. Speak with Chadley to access the simulator. Oh. Titan! Yeah, no, I didn't mean. Wait, I could do this one. Oh, nice. Uh. Oh. <gasps> okay. Uh. No, I actually wanted to do this. Cause now I have I have fire here, but I could put fire and ice. Maybe it would be better for her actually. And just fire here. Okay, cool. And uh, let's put unique. Let's put ice here. And I think we're good. Cloud. 
I have recreated Titan, the <gasps> mythical colossus of the grasslands in virtual let's space. Let's go, let's do it. I encourage you to pit your skills against this summoned entity so that I might complete its materia. I definitely want to do that now. I love your missions. These were amazing. Titan, eh? Oh, wait, what team? Oh, probably... Oh, okay. A three-person battle in which you pick your team, confront the legendary earth-rending colossus known as Titan to gauge the deformed entity's combat prowess. Gee, that's the one we saw, I think, last episode. Emerge victorious against these mighty entities in a combat simulator to be rewarded with their summoning materia. If an entity is proving too difficult, you can gain an advantage of battle by analyzing its corresponding summon crystals found around the world. Makes sense. Full mind might power down. Ah, oh, okay. I see. Oh, can you do a team without cloud? Crazy. I think I'll take these. Yeah, let's try that. I'm excited. It's like a boss, kind of, you know? Better be a bit difficult. Hello. Here we go. Hello, my dear sir. Oh, fly. It's fine. Allow me. Okay, it's wind. All right. The music. Exploiting its elemental weakness, blocking or evading certain attacks, and counter-attacking will pressure it. Destroying its barrier will pressure it for longer than usual. His barrier, eh? Oh, oh, oh. Oh. Sorry. Oh boy, we're not doing too good. Oh. Don't overdo it. I'll show you what I can do. That'll do. Uh, mountain crusher. Oh, that was crazy. I use oh cannot be used the items why not what? okay we're dead for sure there's no way get <laughs> ready you'll be blown away oh boy well, <laughs> okay. <laughs> Wait a minute. Uh, I thought we had more heal. We have only one. Okay, wait. I need to change my materia. <laughs> wait a minute. <laughs> this is very difficult. Having an off day. I wish. <laughs> that did not go well. Uh. We'll do this. And HP up is fine. I was thinking maybe having red 13 would be helpful. Maybe instead of cloud, actually. 
Maybe. I like Cloud for counter attacking as well. Sorry. I want to try this. Poison, steel. Yeah, maybe we could try with Red 13. You all the best in your ongoing hunt for world intel. I should just call him Red. Well, I'm like Red wow. 13. Have you spotted any rack? From what I've observed, so if you spot a burrow, oh. you may want I'm to sorry. dig it up with a chocobo. Really? Who knows what sort of things you might find? A rabbit hole? Really? Okay. All right. I'm sorry. I was skipping. I didn't mean to. <laughs> okay. Hello. Oh boy. All right. Pressing uh, one of the four actions button while guarding L1 will execute a series skill. Yeah, I noticed. Each of these skills function differently and may require you to hold down the corresponding button or tap in quick succession. Press that while guarding will provide impression on these skills. These commands do not consume ATB, but rather help fill parties, party members' ATB gauge. Furthermore, performing synergy skills for the first time with Cloud will improve his relationship with his teammate. I didn't know that! Do it! It's on you. Come on, let's go. Alright! You're up. Woo! No! Woo! Let me do a... Uh... Oh, shit. Woo! Ah! I thought I had it. I should probably cure. My turn. Yes, you're done. Okay, wait a minute. Take him down. This is it. That barely did anything. Oh my lord. Okay. Jet stream. Oh, that's cool. Uh, I wanted to cure Cloud. Actually. Oh, no. Oh lord. No. With me. Ah! 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 Shit! Time to turn That's bad. That's it. Ah! Oh lord. Okay, it was going fine until it wasn't. Wait, seriously? <laughs> Why can't I quit? I don't know. Just kill me. I do this, but it does synergy for some reason. Ah, uh, cause the tutorial. Okay, it's fine. It's your turn yet. Uh, we kind of got it, but for sure you're not supposed to do it that early, I think. But it was it was really fun. I'm gonna try another time, but I don't want to spend all episode on this. This is like by all over again. <laughs> Deal with that. Okay. Leave it to me. Get 
truck. Nice. Oh, I thought I was... Ah. Oh shit. Oh. What do you mean? I'm blocking though. Uh. And annoying. You've got this. I got this. Oh shit, he's going away. Here it comes. Take the lead. Get him. Ah. Ah. What do you mean, dude? Alongside you for a brief period, and the remaining time is indicated by their gradually decreasing gauge. These beings have a will of their own, engage enemy as they see fit, however, you can command them to unleash unique attacks. Yes. When the summon gauge is completely depleted, someone would execute a devastating ultimate attack for its parts. Yes. But I need to Don't not die. <laughs> oh lord. Oh, she's dead. Okay. We're not doing so good. Oh, I didn't mean. I got this. No. Oh, Lord. Oh. Okay. Uh, Jesus. <laughs> Ow. 
get some rest. Jesus. Come on. There's no way, guys. There's no way. But we're learning how to play. I still don't understand how I can do the synergies. Um, I haven't been really able. I was able to do the L1 square and triangle, but I haven't been able to choose it from the command menu, which are like different, I think. And <clears throat> I don't know why that is. Like, it's just, it doesn't fill. I guess you need to use abilities and then it fills. And then you can do synergies, I'm not sure. But uh, yeah. Level sync, okay. I mean, let's try other stuff, maybe? Just another battle. But that's cool, that's cool. But definitely you're not supposed to do it now. Hello. Go on. Oh shit. <laughs> Oh yeah, okay, I've seen. I've seen those. You're up. Don't become incapacitated. Okay, that was the thing you needed to do. Nice. Ah! <laughs> Enemy skill, let's go. Uh then complete the just to learn new enemy skill. The default skill Sonic Bloom deals wind, magic damage, grants bravery, and fate will always be available as long as the material is equipped. Oh. Well, that's very nice. Oh, uh, sorry. I like that. We will continue after. Uh. Let's do this. <sighs> that's it. Okay, we continue. Okay. Out of five, okay. I don't know those, I think. Get ready. With me. Hell yeah. Ready? Do it. Unsure. Is that it? I should have assessed. I think. Shit. Go on. Ready? Keep it up. Best do it right. Wind, of course. It's on you. Follow my lead. Comes down to this. It's all the people. Let me teach him a lesson. Watch out for high winds. You okay? Ow. Okay. It's your 
turn. Hang back. Keep it together. That's the door up. No time to celebrate. Okay, let's see. Wild charge. Trying to understand the synergized stuff, you know? Give me a sec. These I know. Orcs, right? Yeah. No holding back. Jesus. You're mine. Take the lead. Leave it one for you. Ready? I'm coming. Why don't you leave? I got on you. Oh, come on. Good night. You're up. So it's my turn. Let's get serious. Okay. That'll do. <laughs> That's so nice. I'm trying everyone's specialties. I should gain proficiencies as well. Focus trust. Very important. Wolves. I love that the evade now is so much better than in remake because you can pressure enemies with it if you evade at the right time and I feel like it's just overall better to be honest HP up okay I see what it gives steadfast block is really good oh synergy Participate in combat simulator training exercises to learn not only the ins and outs of battle, but also how best to utilize each party member. More such exercises will become available as new allies join your team. Not that some of these simulations will allow you to use abilities you may not have learned yet. That's very cool. I want to see how to use, use those. Music. While guarding, you can team up with allies to perform a variety of synergy skills. Utilizing synergy skills does not consume ATB charges, but instead fills the ATB gauge when they connect. Yes. Depending on which character is being actively controlled, can range from powerful attacks to defensive maneuvers. Yes. Like that. Ah, oh, yeah, I saw that earlier. Nullify a range attack and deliver a counter strike. Like that. Counter fire, right? Different synergy skills may also have different button inputs. Combo skills like bullet, bullet batter, for example, can be activated immediately with a single button press. Repeatedly press the button to continue the combo. Other skills like fire cleave, however, require you to hold down the button to charge up power. Then release to execute the attack. Oh my god, okay. Press the button just as enemy attacks to activate skills like counter fire. That hit. 
You're up. I see. Gotcha. So these are different. You need to have a good relationship, maybe, rather than yes. try this one. Come on, come on, let that hurt. They just do charge, I think, right now. Sloppy. Now, hey. I see. You're up. Got you. I see, I see, I Not see. Come on, ha. Yeah. Let's go. With me. I'm in. Enough. Yeah, you need to Keep charge it, it. okay. Is that it? I see, I see, I see. Interesting. Uh-huh. You can do a lot of different builds and things. Oh, Lord. Oh, I'm sorry. I was about to drink. Let me know. Until last thing, ATP commands will grant character synergy. Yes. I see. Okay, that's what I didn't understand. But he's only dealt, uh, yeah. Duration of enemies staggered is the... Okay. Unlimited MP. Enemy break level. Okay. So we need to use ATB commands marked with that icon. <laughs> oh, I should have... Uh... Let's go. Shit. You're up. Coming. What was it that? Ready? Oh. Wait. You're up. Ah, uh, was too early. Ready? Come on. Huh? Surgy ability supply unique buffs when activated. For example, Partners in Pain raises clouds and Barrett's le limit level by one. Synchro Cyclone, Triple Grand's Cloud, and Tifa Unlimited MP. Relentless Rush boasts increased potency against Tiger Foe and extends the duration of the stagger. Keep these added effects in mind as you fight. I try to make the most of them when an opportunity arises. Let's go. I get that, but. Get ready. <laughs> How do you... She's full, but I'm not. But I don't see the icon. Hit me! I think I need to do this one. Ready? Oh yeah, that doesn't work. Of course. Come on. Nothing to it. Here we go. Deal with that. I got this. Fine. All right. Copy. Okay. I love that. Go. That's so cool. Why? 
With me! You're up. My turn. No, you blast. They are not marked, that's why. Okay, I got it. Ooh, almost. I could do it again. And then we would be able to uh, now it's staggered, so we could we could do this one. Okay, that was uh, way too in yeah. Was never in doubt. We leveled up a uh, material. Okay, I'm still a bit confused how to raise my synergy bars because I don't see which one is marked that I should do to raise that. I'm a little confused, so I'm gonna go in. All these uh, are very interesting, by the way. I'm gonna you do them all. I just feel like simulation. it's not really interesting for you guys. I can't help but wonder where we'll meet next. So many fascinating uh, I need to read the manual because I I don't really get it. Okay, so when you guard, yes, L1. It does not consume ATB, but fails. So you should use that a lot, actually. Uh, the available skill die for depending on which character is actively controlled. Yes. Now, this is what I don't understand. Utilizing ATB commands marked with that. I never see that icon. Am I crazy? Like, I, I never see that icon bes beside a, a, an ATB command. But I know it worked because I was able to do a synergy ability. So... So synergy skills... Is the L1 thing. And then synergy ability is like when you build enough of the synergy. It's just... I don't know. I need to play more, I guess. I don't... I don't see... <laughs> I don't see it, you know? Tifa and Arid right now. I would like a, uh, I would actually, I really like uh, red. So I would like to change maybe. Uh, like that. Uh, actually, it was uh, this, yeah, <laughs> that I wanted. Yeah, I think that's pretty good. Okay. Whew. Uh, happy, you're happy. Okay, that's good. You like me. All right. That's nice. Hey, perfect timing. Pico's all prepped. But first, here. You just give that whistle a toot and your chocobo will come a running. Nice. Calling your bird. Press R1 to use your choco whistle and summon your bird to your side while out exploring. Know that you can only call a chocobo in regions once you have wrinkled that region's bird. Okay. So, who here's never been on chocoback? I haven't. Why don't we take a few laps to get you comfortable then? Come with me. So much fun. Okay, just edit colors. Oh yeah, that's nice. Here we go. Okay, let's try it out. It doesn't work yet. Oh, it does! Ah! Here's where we get our birds in shape for the races. What races? The gold saucers, I mean. They're a big deal in our community. Won't find a ranch around here that doesn't compete. So you guys race too? We've been sitting it out since mom and dad left. But we're gonna get back in the fight soon and kick the tar out of one particularly nasty weasel. 
But never you mind all that. You just focus on the basics, like making sure you don't get thrown from the saddle. <laughs> Why don't you try hopping on Pico and giving me a holler? Yes! Remember now, just give your whistle a blow. What, I just go? This way! Oh, sorry. Oh! Where are you going? Why on the school? Okay, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Woo! Woo! Okay. But how's about we stretch his legs a bit? Writing practice! That's on the chocobo! Use the training ground of Bill's range to get a hang of chocobo ri riding. Pass each of the goalposts in order and complete a course as quickly as you can. Oh yeah. Hell yeah. He's so fast! Woo! Well, that was easy. That was something else. You and Pico are a perfect match. <laughs> Might even have what it takes to win a race or two at the gold Nice. Soccer. We can't thank you enough, Billy. <laughs> oh, that reminds me. Y'all mentioned your flat broke, right? Then you might want to swing by Calm again. <gasps> now that the troopers have cleared out, it's probably oh. safe for you to ask around for work. Here we go. Though, don't run off just yet. My sister's looking for help. Not sure what the trouble is. Didn't want to confide in me for whatever reason. Honestly, she hasn't been herself since mom left. They did dang near everything together. You want to lend Chloe a hand? We need to move on. True, but moving on costs money. Hmm. We had fun helping people in Sector 5, right? Same deal. Our jobs. People... The world over are willing to pay tough guild to for clouds and for higher services. To track these odd jobs, open the map and select quest. Community notice board. Certain settlements will have notice board upon which citizen in need will post job offers, like in The Witcher, The Witcher 3. Accepting a job will mark your new employer on your map. Tack all the odd jobs listed here to earn rare rewards, deepen your bond and your allies and increase your party level. You can warp to any unlocked waypoints such as towns, repair chocobo, stops and activated rim and wave towers. Amazing. Press uh, that <laughs> to open the map and select a location to instantly travel to it. Notice you can only fast travel to chocobo stops on once you have wrangled the region's chocobo. Wow. I see. Oh, wow. Okay. Flowers from the hill. Okay, we're heading to mines after, so I feel like we should complete most of this stuff. Hi, oh, hey, you're back. I heard you might need some New help. Client you did? Oh. I see. Billy talked to you, didn't he? 
I've been meaning to go pick flowers, but the planes are way too dangerous for that. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. As a flower mm -hmm. lover myself, I sympathize. Well, the thing is, I want to make a flower crown. Mom used to make them for us all the time. Aww. So I wanted to give it a try, but with all the monsters, I didn't know how I could. Here's an idea. Maybe we could do the picking for you? Sure. Cloud, thoughts? What happened to your parents? Truth is, our parents died in an accident when I was really little. Billy doesn't like to talk about it. Sorry. But it's Sam's fault. We used fault. to go on these family picnics. And after we were done eating, Mom would make flower crowns for me and Billy. I'd wear mine for days. How do you know Sam? I shouldn't tell you this, but he's the reason Mom and Dad died. That's what Billy says. Okay. I don't know. He always changes the subject when I is ask. Is he really, though? I'll take the job. Of course. Really? You will? The flowers grow on a hill that's got a great view of Midgar. It's kind of far, but a chocobo will get you there quick. Thank you so much. Wait. Oh, Lord. Okay. Uh... Oh my god, there's so many things to do. Uh I fine though honestly they do it really well with the map and everything i have no no problems with it but come on hey let's go oh everyone has one Woo! Woo! <laughs> treasure hunting with chocobos Okay, very treasure is nearby, okay. Sniff the air and face the scent. Once you face in direction of the scent, it will become visible. Excavate, okay. Spot. Okay, we got a rest spot as a treasure. <laughs> oh, <laughs> Woo! I love that. That's so cool. Oh, Moogle, Moogle! What? Pop inside a mushroom shaped mug stool to get a peek at the lives of fantastical creatures who dwell therein. That mushroom. Everyone will be happy, Koopa! 
so crazy. <laughs> what the fuck? Fine. I'll see what I can do. Thanks so much, Koopa! Moogle mischief. Chase the Mooglets around the field to lure them back into the mock stools or catch them and escort them from there them there yourself. Just beware to play full little tricks. Get hit three times, the game will end. Koopo. We gotta hit. Press circle at the right moment to evade. Note that some of their tricks, like the bombs and appeals, cannot be dodged. Over here. Okay, we're missing one. Mookie. With the banana peels. That took a while. That was so Thanks much fun. So much, Turning all the Mooglets, their mock stools will grant access to new shop at which you can exchange Moogle medals for a variety of exciting I and just enticing items. Helping open more importance will increase the Moogles merchant rank, which will in turn expand their selection. Oh! I see, eh? That how it is. Just so you know, there are six more mock stools out there, Koopo. Okay. So be sure to say hi to my friends if you find one. Also, the more emporiums we open up, the more stuff we'll have for you to yeah. buy. That's a win-win situation in my books, Koopo. Koopo! Koopo! What the hell? Let's go see this tower. There's a, a chest. Can we jump over? What is it? Treasure varied by rabbits. 
All right. We did it! Woo! 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 Oh, Lord, that was dangerous. I'm so sorry. I didn't mean... <laughs> Good thing that they... <laughs> they control themselves. <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, we can go down here. All right. This is so nice. I really like the open world so far, guys. I'm gonna say. I think it's great. Really liking it. I don't actually need my... Uh... <laughs> what if I attack while I'm on Chocobo? Oh, okay. Ooh, that was cool. Okay, I see it, the icon now. I was looking beside the name, but it's down. I see. Oh my god, I was so confused. I don't know what the other one means. The other one beside. I see. It's on you. Then we can do another with. Okay. Oh. Ah! I see. Try using it. I think we're almost done. Keep up the pressure. It's okay? over. I've got this. Here goes. Get him. So now, yeah. Okay, I got it. I got it then. I'm sorry, I was confused earlier, but now it's fine. I just want to gain the proficiency. Go on. Get ready! <laughs> Someone looks kinda shaky. I'm backing off a bit. I wasn't so bad. Whoa! Whoa! Um. <laughs> uh. Can't wait to have magnify. Holy. I see, I got it now. Well, I was confused for a second there. <laughs> a second. More than that, but you know what I mean. How do I get down again? R1. So I'll be able to warp back here now. Nice. Okay, so he has... Increases speed by 10. Really now? That's nice. Ooh. Uh... See. 
do we have? Oh, we have another healing now? Very nice. Okay, let's put it here. I don't think we have anything yet. Oh, enemy skill. Maybe steadfast block for you. Enemy damage. Fills the ETB gauge faster when guarding. Love it. Okay, we almost have Arcane Ward, but for Cloud, I could switch back to Sleek Saber. It's a bit stronger. Uh, and for Aerith, we're not there yet. Now, we can teleport, right? Fast travel. It's that easy. Side hustle. Okay, so that's the side quest. Cross the swamp with Choco Bag and head for the Midville Mine. Okay, I want to do side hustle. By going like here. Fast travel, yes. Oh, great, 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 great. I love it. I really like how they did everything. How they are managing the open world, basically, I think it's... Tom is currently on high alert. There's currently a culture activities to essential business. Hello there. Snaps. Inspiring, isn't it? The view. I'm Snaps, by the way. Shutterbug and card-carrying member of the Association of Photography Aficionados. Mind if I get a shot of you? For posterity. Uh. <laughs> Pretty as a picture. You see the you same dude that was taken. I don't think so. Camera. But what about behind it? <gasps> so, apparently, there's a rather scenic spot not far from okay. here. Okay. Thing is, this terrain's a bit perilous. At least for your average photog like me. But maybe not for you. If you find the spot, take a moment to appreciate it. Try to view it as a professional photographer might. looking for new spots so if you happen to know cool yeah i hadn't been on this side of calm hmm, at least i don't think so To listening at the same time. So, uh, what do these avalanche people look like? No one knows. They didn't show any pictures on the news. Mm -hmm. How are we supposed to identify them? Uh, just bring up anyone who looks suspicious. <laughs> How about I start reporting you? Damn, girl. That's savage. This is for him. Hey, quit it. <laughs> Actually, we're a Good match. You hussy! Excuse me? Okay. <laughs> In more ways than one, maybe? Yeah, just forget the dude and get together. This is for him! Hey, quit it! It's fine, just skip the dude. <laughs> I'm sorry. I am Baron Kyle Gate. Yes, I've seen this. Okay. Okay, I'm back, y'all. I'm back. I'm back in the game. I'm happy we can go back so soon. That's nice. Ever the whole town will be sticking to high heaven if we can't do our laundry soon. Oh, I was starting to work. I thought you were here to fix them. <laughs> uh, never mind. Yeah, we're more like demolition experts. So unless you want us to blow something up. How can you make jokes at a time like this? 
It's downright distasteful. Uh, anyway, what's going on? It's the Mako Pipe. It's not even a joke. It's, it's true. leak. I paid a wandering merc to patch the thing up. I certainly wasn't about to fiddle with critical infrastructure as a layman. Though I thought I'd hear back from them by now. A merc? Yep. Some hotshot from Midgard's Undercity. Or so they claim. Sounds like a pro we ought to get to know. Oh, you'd like to meet them? Well, if you're that keen, would you mind delivering a message for me while you're at it? It's your standard Mako pipeline, really. Carries a portion of Midgar's yield straight to us. Mm. We'd be lost without it. Hence, my anxiety. We need it fixed ASAP. Our tank's got some left, but we'll soon be running on fumes. Makes me sick to my stomach to watch our supply slowly dwindle like this. That's rough, man. But hey, good opportunity to wean yourselves off that poison. Mm. <laughs> okay, now that one was funny. Our town technicians laid up in bed at the moment, recovering from a fiend attack. We asked Shinra to send someone to fill in, anyone who knows the work, but we haven't heard back. Fortunately for us, that mercenary rolled into town. Without him, we would have been up a creek. All right. You will? Capital! Oh, I haven't introduced myself yet. I'm Fritz Bellinger, the mayor here. I'm sure that mercenary is hard at work over at the warehouse outside of town. Mind asking them to give us an update on the repairs? A simple, it's coming along, would suffice. We're, We're working as hard as we can to get the power grid back online. Mr. Hank, you're the only one who's made a name for themselves in the Undercity. So you don't know who he was talking about? Nope. Not a clue. You're the only hotshot I know. <laughs> Most Undercity mercs don't go bragging about being ex-soldier. True. A rare card lost. Bartender with a losing streak. That beat bad at Queen's Blood, but the real stinger was when I had to give up the rare card I had staked on the match. I'm looking for a pro to win him back on my behalf. If you think you've got what it takes, drop by the bar. I okay, I got that in the wild and livestock's bane. Clever fiend of some sort's been preying on my livestock of late. If I can put a stop to it, my farm's doom. Seems clear a run of the mill hunter won't cut it, so I'm in the market for a merc with solid tracking skills. Yes, I'll take all of them and just do I guess you just do them whenever you want, right? Like it's just it's whatever. You you just Okay, here we go. You just do them... It, it, they don't really matter. They're not per chapter, I'm guessing. Unless there's probably, of course, some uh, point of no return in the game, but probably like near the end, right? So we could do these whenever. Um, so I'm thinking right now to just do this. Uh, and maybe off camera I'll do like the Chadley stuff, you know, that is a bit more boring, I guess. And we can... Uh, at least we can try to... Uh, to advance the chapter a little bit. Because we're still in chapter 2, I think. So we can go to... Here with Chocobos. Oh wow! Okay. I guess we'll be able to come back, like... I should have saved, it's been a while. Wow, so, incredible. Sure this is safe. Heard pockets of the bar what is that? The bottomless. Plus, there's that giant man-eating serpent. Uh, Those assured us the chocobos could handle it. Have some faith in our feathered friends. <laughs> what is that? Hey, Cloud, do you notice any sparkling minerals yeah. nearby? These are known as guide stones, crystals that direct travelers to shrines to the divine. The stones emit light when they shatter, producing an illuminated path. If ever you're lost, try smashing one. Following the light should lead you to a sanctuary set to honor the tutelary deity of a given region. Okay. The shrines contain untold divine knowledge, slumbering within massive crystals. 
I can use this knowledge to strengthen your summoning materia. So I encourage you to seek out said sanctuaries. I see. So this one here. Grasslands are home to Titan Sanctuary. Oh. In the Age of Myths, when Titan rose from his subterranean prison, he created a massive earthquake. Thus did a vast swath of land rise from the sea, becoming the Grasslands. Uh... Okay. Aha! Sanctuaries contain precise knowledge of summons which will strengthen your summoning materia. The path to sanctuary is lined with guide stones. Break one to release the light that will lead you to the sanctuary. Yeah. Here. These rem remnant stuff, proto relic, uh, and the architecture reminds me of Mass Effect Andromeda a little bit. <laughs> Positively incredible, Cloud. I can't recall ever seeing a crystal of this caliber before. To think the secrets of the divine dwell within. I cannot wait to see what sort of intel our analysis will yield. You'll need to synchronize with the crystal before I can extract data on the deiform entity. I'm counting on you. Examining a summon crystal will reveal its memory match matrix. A series of points will appear in order and you must memorize their position and necessary timing. The point will then disappear and you must make inputs at the correct time to replicate the matrix. If you succeed, you will weaken the summon in its combat trial, straighten its corresponding materia. I see. Yes. I want to attempt. Now it shouldn't be as hard when we try to beat him. Awesome. Analysis complete. I managed to extract the necessary data from the crystal. This should allow me to strengthen your materia. And we can. This is the summon, so I can beat it. The music is so cool. That was amazing. Very nice. Okay. Cool. 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 I like that mini game. It's it's easy, you know, easy enough. I mean, it could it could get really complicated. Don't get me wrong, but it's just fun. I feel like not too complicated. You know, you understand quickly what to do. Yeah. I should see. I haven't hard saved in so long. Here we go. Woo, sanctuary. Ah, oh, that's where we need to go. Okay, gotcha. That's so nice. Look at them, their little legs. It's so cute. Oh. Oh, oh, over there. That's a hooded man. That's Sephiroth, of course. It's Sephiroth. <gasps> what? It's a hooded man, yeah. Come on. Wait, there's a weapon. There's a weapon. Wait, <laughs> wait. There's enemies as well. Let's get 
we don't have the bonus of our Akane Award. Yes! Parrot! But we haven't gotten uh, uh, focus shot. Almost there. Almost there. Okay. I do like Red and Aerith and me as a team. I think that's so, 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 so much fun. Hello? I don't see Sephiroth. Do you? No. I don't. Okay, so what are you doing here? <sighs> Is Genova near then? You can send while you're in the swamp. <laughs> So I could see him for a second there. I thought maybe Sephiroth projected, but I guess it was just Cloud seeing him. Sort of like an hallucination, but he's not wrong though. He can Is definitely. Dry land, I see. Let's go. Oh no. <laughs> Oh no, is that mid Midgar some something? <laughs> oh no. Hey, get back here right now! <gasps> oh no. <laughs> it disguised itself as an island. Gee, I had noticed. Focus. Amazing! I did! No holding back. No. 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 God. Get ready. Go on! That's it! I have to do that. Immense serpent that dwells in the swamp lands. It strikes at any creature winters its territory, pulling the newfound prey into its coils and then swallowing them whole. Potent venom drips from the base of its fang, toxifying the water in which it lives. Inflicting enough damage by exploiting its elemental weakness will pressure it. Hitting it with synergy abilities will pressure it instantly. Ice. Do it! Let's go! No. no, that was wrong. Let's go. Jesus, we are not doing too good right now. Let's do this. Keep it together. So it's my turn. Lord. Get him. <laughs> For me. Okay. That'll do. You can do it. Go on. Leave it to me. Come on. Go for it. Take it over. I think this might be our chance. Careful. This thing's already pissed off enough. 
one with red 13 basically I think I think cloud has a get back cloud has ice I think fire and ice it's time to do ice Everyone, keep your distance. Woo. Your material has improved enough uh, that more potent spells are available. For example, in the Skills of Fire spell, yes. Firaka, yeah. To access a more powerful spell, press these. Yeah. Cura. Oh, nice. Okay. This one's for you. So nobody has ice right now. We could do this. On it. Let's go. Don't give up now, you guys. Woo! Certain surges ability to raise the characters to be double. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ascension at level two. Okay, also unlock level 3 limit break attacks to your character's folio. Oh. You okay? Woo! Ow. You can do it. Leave it to me. Okay. Where? Keep your guard up. <gasps> no! Oh, Come on! Here we go! This is so intense. The music is so good. <laughs> Ariel is so awesome! What do you mean? So it's my turn? That's it! Enjoy the ride! I'm not sure that worked. <laughs> Woo! Okay! Uh, go for it now. Let me get closer. Limit. It's your turn. I'll end this. Get make the most out of this. It's better. Yeah. 
Immune? No, you're in for it. What did I do? Uh, let me see. I have a limit. I have ascension right now. Sure. Gotta give Why it my not? Okay, good. What's going on? Oh boy. Oh boy. We're not doing too good. We need to, um... The music! What the hell? Ramu, why not? Let's go. Thanks for coming to help. <laughs> Woo! The music is so heavy metal, kind of. No, it's more like rock, to be honest. But still. How am I immune right now? I have. Oh, I have planet protection. I think that's why. Scorching breath, scorching breath, scorching breath. It's fine. Uh Where? Keep your guard up! <laughs> Wait, was it always that color? <laughs> bravery. It has bravery right now. <laughs> Thermal absorption. What? Oh, we're almost there. Uh I'll keep it together. I'm coming. Get out of the water. Hurry. Oh, okay. Get out of the water. Woo! Oh, that was crazy! Okay. Oh, what the fuck, dude? <laughs> Fuck, I didn't have the time. Oh, wait, yes, I did. Never mind. <laughs> Shit. Succumb to my friends. fun though i like it oh, i feel like we almost had him um, i don't use my synergy skills uh enough is is what i'm uh, i'm noticing damn 
I'm sorry, guys. That's disappointing. <laughs> I usually do better than that. <laughs> Holy shit. All right. Huh? What? I should uh, actually change um, I was thinking uh, changing my party maybe this like that oh and we need a uh, ice material we didn't have ice material so that's that's not helpful. <laughs> Do you have ice? But it's fire and ice. I don't understand why I was not able to activate ice. That's like, that's strange, no? Isn't it strange? <laughs> I didn't see ice in my... Maybe there was blizzard and I didn't notice. I was too... Ah, going crazy, you know? I don't know. Anyways, let's do this again. We can do it. It's not that hard. Come on. But I think with a ranged with a uh, with Barrett is gonna be uh, Let's go. It's gonna be a bit easier. No holding back. Get him! Oh yeah, I should probably I got your number. Okay, yeah, now we have Blizzard. Deal with that. I'll take care of them. Shit. Shit. I think this might be our chance. Careful. Uh this thing's already pissed off enough. No, no. Perfect. Oh lord. Go on. You can go. Need my help, do you? Ah! Ooh, got a love fool. Ah! 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 Oh, okay. Something just for you. Bring in the heat! Wow! Maximum fury! I love it! All people mad with your name on it! Okay. Get back! up to something. Don't overdo it. I'll take care of 
Let's 
I beg of you, shield them from harm. We'll be back. Stay sharp. I think Claw would be better. Oh, come on. You know what? Yes. Let's dance, asshole. Woo! Woo! We did it! Let's go! I'm sorry, I did really badly, I feel like. It's just Is getting it used to everything, you know? Jesus. Oh, come on. Ew. Cloud. What? That's really deep. What the fuck? That's not a swamp, that's an ocean. Ooh. Oh, we just had like a memory thing. Yeah. Sephiroth. I heard the music. What? Ah, can I fight? Underwater with Sephiroth? Imagine. Oh. Convenient. Very nice. How is his hair perfect underwater? Have you back, Cloud? <sighs> Sephiroth? I knew he was strong, but still. Those guys are looking for him, too. They've got to be. Yeah, I kind of get that feeling as well. Let's not lose her. You cannot swim through the swaplands now that he's gone. I, uh, I'm gonna stop here actually. I've played for way too long, holy. Uh, why do I have... Okay, here's here's my uh, thinking. I have a feeling that uh, Sephiroth was not there at all. We just imagine him. And this thing that just happened with like the lightning on the water and the wind shit is actually Cloud that did. Like without knowing that he has that kind of power. Maybe. Because why would Sephiroth save us now? I mean, he clearly needs us for some reason, but nobody else saw him. Nobody else has seen him, and... And how would he appear like that? Like, that's just crazy. So I have a feeling that Cloud is actually the one who did... Um, that crazy magic we just saw as like a last 
um, moments of life type of thing, you know, when you feel like you're about to die or something like that, you just go a little... And why did did Erit say... Do you remember who I am? As if, as if he had waken up before and not know. Does that make sense? Like as if, as if she had she had waken us up before, just a couple of minutes ago maybe, and we didn't recognize her. And now we woke up again and we did. It's kind of like we're possessed in a way. Do you know what I mean? I don't know. I don't know. It's just the way it was, uh, like, why would she say that? Do you remember? Like, you wouldn't say that when you when someone almost drowned. It doesn't really impair, you know, that kind of short-time memory. Like, I, I don't know, long-term even for her. Like, you would say, are you are you okay? Or like, the, the, uh, like can you breathe? You know, that, that type of thing. You wouldn't say, do you remember who I am? Or do you remember me? Like... That's such a weird thing to say. Maybe, um... Oh, shit. Maybe... You know, at the beginning of the game, I actually wondered why... I think it was last episode or the previous one that I talked about this. But you know how Sephiroth can use the hooded men as vessels? You know? He can kind of, like, possess them. So maybe that's what just happened. I I, I thought at first, I'm like because I'm talking about it now, I'm thinking that. But I thought maybe maybe Sephiroth was never there and we just imagine him because we can't understand the power we have inside us and then it just it just happened. But actually maybe Sephiroth was controlling Cloud as like a vessel to save him. Because it was definitely Sephiroth magic, does that make sense? It was like purple, like crazy magic, right? And power. So maybe... He like... Took a side seat in, in Kyle's mind. Does that make sense? Like took the passenger, like, no. Cloud took the passenger seat in his own head and then Sephiroth was controlling. And then Cloud fell unconscious, but Sephiroth was still controlling. So when they pulled him out of the water, he didn't recognize them. But he's seen them before. He's seen Aerith, I think. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, maybe I'm overthinking this, but it's just weird how it was uh, talked about. I feel like uh, there is more behind, behind it than just being Sephiroth suddenly appearing out of nowhere to save Cloud. Like... I feel like he must have sensed that Cloud was not doing good and he used them as a vessel to save him because he needs us for something later. He doesn't want us dead. Something like that. I don't know, but uh, we'll end it here. Uh, that was very long. I'm, I'm sorry. I mean, you guys, I know you guys like it when it's uh, longer episodes, but I didn't mean it to go for so long. It's just that the side quests and such, you know, are so interesting. I'm going to do some stuff off camera, I think. Probably like the towers, stuff like that, you know. Um, side quests I'm going to keep for on camera, I think. But I definitely want to do some stuff like these. Um, divine Intel. Maybe I'll do the Grassland Scenic spot on, on camera. But like the rest, I, I'm going to do all the Chadley as well. I'm going to try to do that before I, I film next time. I don't know if I'll have the time. But I'll do those off camera, I think. Cause it's Well, let me know in the comments, guys. If you want to really see everything. But I doubt it. Like those things are just not as interesting in my opinion for you guys so i'll probably do them off camera but that was super super fun riding chocobos i mean that's the big highlight of the episode for me i'm gonna be honest i was hoping so much and yes it's actually a thing and they're so cute and yeah just ugh, amazing and now i understand a little bit more the the synergy uh, stuff I should use L1 square triangle X circle stuff more I should definitely do that because they build ATB faster so we should use that and then I understand now 
which ability has like the icon of ATB and you need to build those a little bit like a banishment with Yuffie, you know, with Yuffie you had to use for example um, art, arts of war or something like that I don't remember exactly and then you used it multiple times to make banishment stronger you know and it's kind of similar but it's not to make it stronger it's just to use it to use a, a synergy uh, ability instead of just skills ability with someone else and I noticed that I don't have any with Barrett and I don't have any with Red 13 I think I have only with um, Erit and Tifa so far, maybe? And it changes your relationship to... Oh, only uh, Tifa likes us so far. But yeah, um, I really like that. I think that's an interesting new gameplay mechanic. Uh, you just need to get used to it, you know? And I think you're immune to damage when you do it. I'm not sure, though. Kind of like a limit. Limit breaks, you're immune to damage while you do it, so I don't know if that's the case for a uh, synergy ability as well when you're both doing something unsure, but um, I will need to check maybe when I edit. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this episode like I did playing, and I'll see you in the next one.